fly healthy. All right. Josh is looking for a second date update with Heather. Hi, Josh. How are you? Hey, man. What's happening? Not much. Take us from the beginning. How'd you meet Heather and how'd the first date go? <sighs> All right. Look, look, she's great. She's a great woman, dude. Like, we had an incredible night. And um, I guess the colony, because she, she disappeared. <laughs> she ghosted me, bro. Um, we met on Bumble. We talked for a couple weeks before we actually met up. So me and her, we had a really good foundation before the first date. So it felt like we kind of knew each other and we got all the awkward stuff out the way before we actually met. Um, I knew about her. She knew enough about me that, you know, it didn't feel like we was meeting as strangers, if that makes any sense. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, and it was pretty comfortable right off the bat. You know, I knew that I was going to be attracted to her. But she was even prettier in person, bro. I, I, she's like, I can't put it where she's a knockout. She's a 10. She's a freaking 10. Oh, that's great. And, um, like it when that happens, but, huh? But more, <laughs> but more than anything, she had the vibe, you know what I'm saying? She just had this really, really chill vibe to her, and that's what did it for me. Um, and I think she picked up on the vibe, you know? We was vibing. Um, so she and, okay, the fast forward, she invited me back to, to her place. Um, and I stayed the night. Look at you. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So like all this boom, 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 like everything's just going and it was really good. <laughs> I mean, I'm not going to, I mean, it was really, really good. Let's just put it that way. Okay. Um, uh, in the morning, it was like super romantic. It's like she sent me off with a cup of coffee and a Danish and like a nice kiss. It well, was that just was like, nice. A Danish. It was like the perfect, <laughs> I liked it. Did it have a did it have a lot of frosting on the Danish? Was, was it cheese, fruit or cheese? Or cheese, cheese or yeah, it sounds what? like it you spent cheese, the night at Jen's house. It was a cheese Danish. Yeah, it was good, man. Cheese it was good. I mean, you got to really rate high to get one of my Danishes. Because <laughs> <laughs> I tend to hoard my Danishes, but right. that's good. That's good. Good sign. So okay, so so here's the thing. So all of that, I think I'm okay. I'm in there. You know, I I told her I call her later. She smiles. I leave. All right, um, but. When I did call her later, she didn't answer. Huh. So I texted her. You know, I'm not going to be like, oh, well, you know, like blow her up. But I texted her and she didn't reply to the text. I tried a couple more times and bro, bro just, nothing vanished. Mm, <laughs> um, hmm. So I don't got I don't have any really clue to what's going on with her. But I know I'm, you know, I did everything right. I couldn't have done anything that was jacked up, you know. And it's bugging me, bro. I'm not going to lie. It's bugging me. It's bugging the hell out of me. So for the last, you know, week or so, I've been like, you know, um, so there I am <laughs> asking you for help. You know? okay. Yeah. Uh, Josh, have we ever spoken to you before? Yeah, bro. It's It's been a minute, but I talked to you guys a few years ago. It was another little weird situation that you kind of helped me extricate myself from. But yeah, bro. What How you doing? The, what was the story there? Did you yeah. call for a second date update or did we call you? Yo, it was it was a weird girl situation. She had a, you know what I mean? She had a situation going on and she was trying to burn me up, bro. So Oh, God. I Lennon Bridge is falling down. That's right. Lennon I forgot she, about that. Yes, you remember. <laughs> Hi. Yeah. Oh, okay. Wow. I got What's it. What's good? What's good? <laughs> right. You have a voice huh. that I don't think I will ever forget. <laughs> so true. Oh, you don't forget that she was burning, brothers. That's what you don't forget. Yeah, she that's was right. Yeah. No, you don't. Down, I remember yeah. you saying that. <laughs> forget oh. Yeah, buddy. Um, okay. Ah. But, but you're you still in the clear, right? I mean, you spent the night over. You never did develop the virus. Oh, hell no. Okay. Hell okay. No. Wait, we'll just check. <laughs> no, 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 okay. no, no, okay. no, 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 make sure we got full disclosure no, with no, Heather no, here. Yes. No, bro, I, 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 dude, I, I, like, ran, like, Bruce Willis out the building before it blew up. I, dude, I'm clear. That's so I made funny. It. <laughs> okay, God. well, it's it. great to hear you again. It's a little diehard reference for anyone. Call me diehard, bro. You're going to take a lot more to, to get rid of me. Yep. Okay. So how was the Danish delivered? Because that was the last time you saw her. She gives you a Danish the next morning after this 10 out of 10 night. Yeah, it was great. Like, she bring it to me. We had a little moment there in the morning, and then I was on my way. So, like, we left it. We left it on a 10 for me. Okay. You know what I mean? We, okay, it was great. good. Okay. Okay. Sounds good. All right. Well, let's take a break. When we come back, we'll call her up, see what she had to say about Josh and her date with him coming up. Next, Jeff and Jen, Cincinnati's Q102. Okay.
Okay, Josh met Heather on Bumble. And when they met, it was great. They got all the awkwardness out of the way. Uh, she's even prettier in person. 10 out of 10, according to Josh. Great date. Incredible night. Stayed the night. She gave him a Danish the next morning, which any man will tell you. I mean, that's love right there, baby. <laughs> it's something. Well, yeah, maybe not love. <laughs> Depends on how you feel about pastries. If it's your love language. Yes. Love is, comes food, in many forms. is food a love language? Yes. 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 Are you crazy? <laughs> Absolutely. But after that, so so he left, as, as you described it, Josh, you left on a 10. Things felt great. So you follow up with a phone call. She doesn't phone answer. Phone call, text, yeah. nothing, bro. Wow. She ghostbusters. Okay. We're back. So let's call her up and see what's going on. Hello? Hi, is this Heather? Yeah. Hi, Heather. It's Jeff and Jen at Q102. How are you? <laughs> what? Jeff and Jen. I know exactly who you are. This is second date update. Oh, my God. It is a second date update. You're right. Mm-hmm. Well, it was almost accusatory. Like this, whole, this second date update is all your fault. Uh-oh. Why? It's our fault. What did we do? I blame you guys for this not working out. I, I honestly, God, I really do. Do you guys remember a while back when you guys talked about how you shouldn't sleep naked because you fart in your sleep and you're spreading all kind of nastiness all over the sheets? Do you remember that? Yeah, yes. we don't do that. Jen does that. But this... <laughs> no, but it was not yeah. true. Yeah. I never sleep naked. Oh. I can't stand it, that. It was in news that didn't make the news. Yeah, yeah. it was. Yeah, yeah. I, remember I remember the story. That story. That's uh-huh. why I want to wear underwear mm-hmm. or something. Have a protective yeah. layer around. I do right. remember that. Yeah. Mm-hmm. This is one hundred percent, y'all. Okay, he's at my place. He's sleeping naked. And he just starts packing gas all night long. Oh. I mean, it kept me up. It just kept me up thinking about just like fecal matter all over my shoes. <laughs> <laughs> just being covered in like fecal matter, fecal, 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 fecal. And I mean, I was just. That's all I could think about. I was so grossed out. I'm sorry that we like did that. Like men with beards. Ever since you talked about the fecal matter and the really long beards, because men don't wash mm-hmm. their hands mm-hmm. and then touch their beards, every time I see them, I cannot help but think of, of I that. wonder how much fecal poo matter, is in matter. your beard. Mm-hmm. Yes. Mm-hmm. And you're welcome. <laughs> I know he's on the line, but like, listen, then when I saw his face the next morning, it was just, it was just gone. I mean, I wasn't attracted to him anymore. It was just all night. Just nasty, like just doodle everywhere. It was I was just oh, like, yeah. it's a Danish and your doodle butt. Go ahead. <laughs> I don't think I'll ever be the same. Like I, I, I threw out my sheets. I swear to God. I you threw out sheets. your sheets. I threw out my sheets. Oh, that's a that's a bit. So no, just washing them in hot water would not have been to, enough. If I had to venture a guess, this is not the last man you will ever be with. People fart in their sleep. Yeah. All the time, yeah. yeah. Now the, the, the requirement is you need underwear on to catch, to catch a doo because it's not going to go all over my sheets. I'm not, no. Mm-mm. Yes. So you won't even entertain a second date with him? No. Even if he wears underwear? No. Okay. <laughs> The, these farts were the no. What did you guys eat? No. I know, but it, maybe it's they had a couple drinks. That happens sometimes the when beer people farts. get yeah, yeah. You start yeah. to get a little. I mean, especially if they went to Oktoberfest, they may have had you know some beers, mm. some sauerkraut balls. <laughs> Things get really gross. Oh. <laughs> You're just making this so terrible. Well, Josh, I could not have predicted this. I'm sorry, man. I don't know what to tell you, bro. This is bullshit. I'm sorry, man. This is this is like 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 how childish can you be, bro? Blame like, them. Yeah, like I took a sh- on yeah. your bed. You said Blame it's our them. fault, still. Blame yeah. them. Blame them. Blame them for that stupid story. I'm sorry. I would have never thought about it before if I hadn't heard them talking about it. Honestly, I think it ruined my life. Like I, 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 <laughs> I think no. it ruined my life. I mean, <laughs> you ruined my life. This is like, can I get MTV True Life? You guys ruined my life. I don't think I can ever sleep with a naked man ever again. I think I now have like some weird like fecal phobia, if that's a thing. Like, it's got to be because like, there are a lot of people that freak out about fecal matter. When we, we, you know, you do stories about, mm-hmm. you know, it's spraying out of the toilet onto your toothbrush. Stop it. Oh, no, 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 no. See? Gotta go, gotta go. <laughs> <laughs> you, 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 you acting like I wipe my ass.
with her sheep, yo. A like, grown ass man, he passes gas. That's what we do. You know what I mean? I'm a human being. I got biology, or whatever you call it. No, biology, going on. no, no not, not like, not like what you were doing. Not like what you, yo, what you were doing. That was was it, okay, 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 okay. Well, hold on a second, because I'm trying not to get pissed here. But so you saying something involuntary? You gonna you gonna get on me for something that's involuntary? Like, come on, bro. Like, listen, that's bro, a listen. If you process, knew, like, if you knew that you were gonna be Putin all night, you should have put underwear on. No, I should have left is what I should have done. I should have never come over there because you coming off me or sideways, like left field, like. I'm coming sideways. I'm not coming at you. I'm coming at your butt. No, 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 no. no. I'm please, coming at no, your please. butt. Yo, you whack, yo. I'm, I'm sorry, yo. Jeff and Jen, I'm sorry. I'm too good for this. This is this is, this is is weird to me. A grown-ass man passed gas. You get up there and like, well, good, good luck finding somebody who ain't got an ass. Because we all got one. <laughs> yeah. Josh is back, you know? Right. You well, yeah. you know, all you know, I missed you, buddy. Oh, boy. Yeah. Sometimes you got a root toot toot. You know what I mean? It's all good. Whatever. No, that's a lot. That was a lot of toot tooting. <laughs> hey, whatever, baby. No whatever, baby. Hey, no, this is not that. My colon work, my lower intestine works, my ass work. Hey, I'm all good. I'm whatever. I'm so or X happy to the next, for you, but keep, X, keep no, that. X to the next. No, X to the next. No, X to the next. Because you ruined a good thing. We had a good thing, and you're gonna ruin it over some on some bullshit now. Whatever. They ruined it. I didn't ruin it. They did. Boom. Well, whatever. this is deteriorating. X to the next. Yeah. You know, Jeff I'm and sorry, Jeff and Jen. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. So I wasted your morning with somebody this whack. Next time it'll be somebody better. I hope you enjoyed I'll your Danish. You I hope good. you enjoyed your Danish. It was the first time you ever had one. I okay. opened your and you sh- your sh- How about that? You're just sh- you worried about I, I probably sh- am now. I probably am because of you. You're just a sh- person. Oh. How about that? I, I fought it, but you're a sh- person. Boom. I, I really don't care. You pooped all over my sheets. I don't care either. You don't care and I don't care. So boom, we both don't care now. So we okay. don't care. Bye. All right, I gotta go. Yeah. Whatever I gotta the, go. Whatever, this is, whatever this is not working what? out. I'm not sitting here arguing. Whatever, whatever, whatever. <laughs> whatever, whatever. Yep, 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 yep. That's cool. Sorry, <laughs> Jeff and Jen. <laughs> I wish you both just... Yes, thank you both for coming on Second the Date best. Update. The best. So stupid. Act like you don't got an ass. Come on now. I have a great ass, and I can control it. She probably wears <sighs> underwear, too, when she goes to sleep. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. Just farting all over a stranger's sheets like you're <laughs> gross. You're nasty. <laughs> thank you, guys. Thanks, Good guys. luck to you both. Good I to talk to you, Josh. Probably fart, you probably fart in the elevator. Like, I, I, I hope I shot it, too. I hope that. I shot it just a little bit. I hope I shot it just a little bit. Yeah, we had to separate those two. <laughs> Man. But, you know, that, that kind of fierce chemistry. What are you going to do? Always makes me wonder. What are you going to do? Yep. All right. So if you need our help with the second date update, just send us an email. Jeff and Jen at WKRQ.com.